Hello. Hello. Yes, my friend, you are live on air. What do you want to say to us? Oh, okay. I have some uh, regarding some verses of the Bible that, unfortunately, I wasn't able to ask someone else. What about the topic we are speaking about? Uh, I'm not sure exactly what topic you're speaking about. The, the topic we are saying three reasons Allah cannot be God. Allah. Mm. Okay, Allah is not God, yeah? Cannot be God. Cannot be God. Yeah. Can I clarify? Can I ask a clarification? Like, when you say Allah, you mean Allah in Islam or Allah in general? What well, is Allah in Islam, Islam in general? Allah is the God of Islam. But isn't I'm it, saying when you say Allah is in the name, Allah. No. Allah is a name, my friend. To... Allah is a name. And Arab yes. Christian, they use the word Allah because they are forced to use it after 1400 years of occupation. We don't believe in Allah. Allah is a pagan God. He is the moon God. So if I read in the Arabic Bible where it says, This is a false translation. This is what I say. This is a false translation. This is a translation. There's no. Why don't you translate it as Ila? Why don't you put Ila or Rab? Uh, no problem. I'm saying, I just said to you, this is false translation. Okay, I'm, I'm just saying that's what I've read in the Arabic Bible. Okay, let me let me show you what I read now in the Quran. It says the word Jesus. Can you find the word Jesus in the original Quran? Jesus. Now you want the word Yeshua? No, no. I'm asking you. Can you find the the name of Jesus? Yes, Yeshua or Yeshua or even Jesus? Can we find it in the Quran? No, right? If you if you're using those names, then no. Okay. We so that's mean, those names. So that's, that's mean the Quran when the name Jesus appeared. That's mean the Quran is giving false translation. Do you agree? I do not believe that. I believe that the Isa is a name of Jesus as well. Okay, I'm no, not denying that. No yes, problem. But uh, is is that a correct is that a correct translation to say Jesus when the Quran never says Jesus? If it says Isa, which is in reference to Jesus, hmm? because Allah doesn't. Just How you know that this Isa is reference to Jesus? Quran How you know that Jesus? this is reference to Jesus? Hold on, hold on. In the Quran, Allah hmm. uses three different things to refer to Jesus. He doesn't just call him Isa. He says Aisa ibn Maryam. So it clarifies that he is the son of Mary, hmm. number one. Hmm. Number two, it calls him Al-Masih. Hmm. So we're not confused. It clearly says Al-Masih. Hmm. And last time I checked, Christians only believe Jesus This is not is the, the question, Messiah. my friend. This is not the question. The question is, why Allah did not call Jesus by his correct name? Well, why? But you're the one saying it's incorrect. Well, nobody heard of his name before. You know, we are the Christian, we believe in Jesus, and we have our Bible. We never heard of Isa. Who is Isa? Can you tell me who is Isa? We never heard of Isa. So you, you're saying that from? Isa cannot you, be a name of Jesus. Do you yeah? have do you have an uh, like a pre name for this like any any history reporting the name Isa before? Any book before Muhammad? But I'm saying, did yeah? you hear what I said before? I said Allah in the Quran, he does not only mention the name Isa to refer to Jesus. No problem, he no says, problem. Do you, do you know where the name is coming from? What Isa mean? Can you tell me what Isa mean? What does the, the, the meaning of the name? Yeah. I would assume that the meaning comes from the original Aramaic, which the name derives from. What is name what? I said I would refer uh -huh. to the meaning in Aramaic in which the actual name derives from. Okay, but what the meaning of the name? Isa? Yeah. Uh, I'm not. I'm not sure. What I, Allah, uh, what Allah mean? The meaning in Aramaic. Okay. What Allah mean? Don't tell me you do not know what the name of Allah mean. What Allah mean? Allah hmm? is a contraction hmm. between Al and Ila, meaning the God. No. Okay. You see, you are you are a, you speak Arabic, right? Which will make it a lot easier for me. Uh, I do not Arabic. I do not know Arabic. So why well, you are typing, why you are typing Arabic. your name in Arabic at the top of your Skype? Uh, because I I. I mean, because I can understand what I wrote. I mean, is there is something wrong with putting somebody's name in How Arabic? How you can understand what you wrote if you do not know Arabic? I said I don't know Arabic in depth. I said I know basic Arabic. I know. So here we go. You see, you type your name in Arabic, but you do not know Arabic. Does it say here in front of me? Look at this. Chapter 1, verse number 2. It says, Alhamdulillah. Do you agree with okay. this? Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Okay. Li, what li mean? Two. Two. And lah. Allah. Thank you. So, guys, Allah, his name is, and here we go, Mr. Uh, I don't know what to call you. What's your name? Amir. Amir. Mr. Amir, he agree that this is uh, Alhamdulillah. This is, which means thanks to Allah. Li, he said, and I'm just quoting what he said. I will type it in the screen. Li. And then the name is Lah. Everybody heard you. So your name, God, is Allah. It's not Allah. And it's not Al-Ilah. And everybody heard you. Li la. So li -la. no, li la. No, li li. This li, li, li. When you say lil, you are repeating the same letter twice. Lil. You see it. There's two letters. Li la. 
So we say it fast, we say Billah, but the fact is Li, and you said Li mean to everybody who. Okay, how do, you, how do you say Lilla? How do you spell that in My Arabic? friend, you just did. Here we go. Li. Like, how do you spell it in Arabic? Did, didn't you agree? In My Arabic? friend, did you, didn't you agree? Didn't you agree and say this is mean to Allah? Okay, but here, where is Allah? Where is the word Al? Lilla, Lilla. There's not, it, it, it will be grammatically incorrect if you put an Alice there. My ah, will be grammar. What, what do you mean? You, you cannot take a name, you cannot take a letter out of the name, my friend. If the name is Allah, the name is stay Allah. So when people take out the Alif, they say, like for instance, the actual, I'm sure you've read it, it says, Alhamdulillah, Ya Rabbil Alameen. My friend, didn't you say, Li mean two? And then the word Two. after it. And is, I'll give you. Is, I'll give an example. My friend. In the Quran. No, no problem. No problem. Allah but says, aren't you the oh, one who said oh, oh, that oh, Li oh, mean two? And the word after it is the name of your God. And you said to me, Allah, right away. Allah. Yeah. It's Allah. Okay. So Li La, the your God name is La. Hold on. Okay. Let me mention this. Hmm. Li adding Li to it, by the way, hmm. is just part of his name because uh, there's a lamb in it. Hmm. But let's, I'll give you an example. When Allah says, Muhammad Rahmatul Alameen, yeah? When he says, Rahmatul Lil Alameen, Lil, mm -hmm. what is Lil Alameen here? To, to the world, yeah? Uh. Mm -hmm. Are you going to say that Lil Alameen doesn't My mean friend, to the, the world? Alameen is not a name. What's wrong with you? You cannot take It's a this. word. It's a word. That it's a word, but it's Alif not a name. You cannot take a, uh, the word out. You cannot take out of the name. As an example, you say, Al Masih. The name is Masih. Al is definition. Who is he? So Al Masih. So here, in order to take the letter off, you cannot take a letter off from the name. The name stay as it is. You can take letters off if they are additional anyway. So if we attach them to something else, then we take it off. So, and you are the one who said to me. I said to you, Lil, uh, who is who? What Lil, Lil mean? And you said to the other one is Allah. the name of your God. Okay. Now, listen. Alhamdulillah, and you said that Allah is a word divert. So, what is the name of your God? Allah, which okay, what, is one name. What that name means? Which is one of His names. What that name mean? Allah. I just told you what it meant. The God. The God. So the Allah is a, the is, a, is just a word mean God. It, I it's mean, a, name? It's a name. It's a title. Is it a name or is just a word mean God? It's a title. It's an attribute. It's a name. No, no. Is it a name? Or it is just a word can be used. So uh, can we call Buddha or the God of the 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 the, the, the Hindu, uh, the, the the Hindus? Can we call them uh, their God is Allah? If they believe that that is the divine God, then I don't have a problem with somebody using Allah as long as they say Allah mm. in the context of using it with just their God. And I can show you in the Bible, Elohim is not just used for your God in the Bible; it's used for pagan gods. Elohim, Elohim is not a is not the name. That is the name. No, it's no, not. Show me, show me, show me another name. It says Elohim and Adonai. My friend, the whole Bible, Bible does not God have a, Bible, No, no, no. This, have... Don't teach me my, my belief. You see, when you say something, you you know, you, you are obviously you do not know what you are talking about. Okay, so then what is the, the name whole, of God? What is the name of God in the Bible? What I am. He said to them, I am. When he said Yahweh, that's saying so I, what is Allah, I am. So what does Allah, hold on, hold on. What does God say in the first verse of the Bible? In, uh, in Hebrew, what does he say? What is his name? There's no name. So what is God in Arabic? Sorry, what is God in Hebrew? There's many words. There's Shaddadi, there's Hashim. I'm saying, what is, what is God himself use? I'm not asking what somebody else uses. I am. I'm, I'm I asking am. God. Musa asked Moses God, who are you? What I will say to my people. He said to them, I am. And it's what not... did God say in the first verse of the Bible? My can friend, please... I told you, there's no name. You can read the first verse in the Bible. There's no name. What does it say in Hebrew? What is, what is no the word name. used Show for me God? Name. Don't tell me what's what in Hebrew. What is the word used for you God? Tell me, you on, tell me. No, you tell me. You tell me. You tell me what it says there. Go ahead. I'm asking you what it says. What is the I'm name? I'm learning from you. No, you tell me. No, you word. No, you tell me. No, you tell me. What is the first uh, the uh, word that God uses let, in let, the first let, verse let, of let Genesis? Ask, let me ask you first. Before, before, we, before we continue, do you do you agree with Genesis, the book of Genesis? Do I agree? Why do I have to agree with it to use no. it against you? Okay, I'm not no, no. Leave your book to use it against you. Okay, I'm just asking you when you ask me, what is the name of the God of Heaven? Are you a person who did read the book? Who is the name of the God of heaven? I told you Allah. There's no name. It's a word meaning God. There's no name there. In so the said, beginning, hold on, you just, hold on, the, hold on. my friend, in the word, beginning, yeah? God, he, he created the, word, the yeah? heaven and the earth. This is why in the translation, it appears as God. We don't want to stay you here for said, three hours. My friend, my friend, my friend, my friend, listen, 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 listen. Can I ask you a question? No, 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 no. Listen, you just listen, said, listen, listen. When you debate you somebody, are, you when you said? debate somebody, you need to get him busted. I said, this word there means God. Prove me wrong. 
the, I'm, I'm asking you a question. I said, you just admitted, did you just admit that the word used for God in the first verse is Elohim? Yes, is that correct? My friend, it's a word being God. Doesn't matter what word. it is. It's a word, yes? So what's the name <laughs> yes, of God? Yes, it's a word. It's not a, it's not a name. I just told you what's so wrong with you. What's the name of God? What's the it name of God? Not a, not it is not name a name. name. I am. Are you, are you stubborn for call me I am. You okay, listen, listen. My listen. Name is are I you, am. How old are you? How old are you? 18, almost okay, 19. No problem. Listen, you are a person saying to me, uh, let us say they use whatever word there, but as long as it's not a name. So what's your problem? I'm asking you, what's God's name then? And you cannot say it's I, I am. Said to you, my name I said is to I you am. in the whole Bible, God did not say he have a name. God, he says, I am who I am. So this when you invoke Jesus, God, what do you call him? Jesus, when what you call God? Jesus, each time he say, I am, he is saying, I am God. He only said it one, by the way. He never said it more than once. Where? But uh, the verse in which he says, before Abraham was, I am. Yeah? No. How come he didn't say before no, Adam was? he said, was, I am the truth, I am the alpha, I am the omega, I am the beginning. Hold on, hold on. I am the gate. Like, what are you you're talking about? Dream. Let's go back to, let's go to the Gospels. No, 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 no. You are trying to change things. the topic. Hold on, hold on. We, will go, we, we will go to the Bible. No, let us go focus here. So what is the meaning of your God name? Are, you know, if I show you right now from your Islamic website, it's saying that Allah is a unique name for Allah as the only God. Unique name. Are you going to agree with your Muslim scholars or you will refuse? Which scholars? Which scholars? Which sects? Shia. Are Shia. You Shia. I am a Shia. Yes. Okay. Who? who uh, give me the names of your scholars, please. The names of my scholars. Mm. If you can find me, this is the marja that I follow. Mm. As Sayyid Sadiq Al Husseini Al Shirazi, Hafizahullah. If you can find what he says about the name of Allah in one mm. of his books, I don't know. I haven't read some, a whole lot of his books. I've only read a few of them. Get his opinion, and then I, I'd be I'd be glad to uh, to then answer. So only from a Shirazi, this is your scholar? He is my marja. He's not one, He's not just one scholar I rely on, but he is the main scholar I rely on. Hmm. All right. Hopefully, uh, out of respect for me, please do not quote from Sunni books. That's the only thing I ask. Because unfortunately, people, they just quote from any book, and unfortunately, it's a Sunni book. But okay. good thing you're sticking to the Quran. I can respect that. All right. Well, here we go. Uh, I'm just going to show you a Shia website. Uh, I'll be honest with you. I wanted to address certain things about what God in the Bible does or is said about him. I don't want to say he does it in actuality. And see whether or not you can, you know, whether or not you have a problem with this. Whether my, friend, you... my friend, my friend, my friend. Let us not to mix things together, all right? So you want to talk about you want to talk about the Quran, but you don't want to talk about the Bible. Which you no, can... no, we are talking about the Bible anyway, because you see, you, you know, obviously you do not know much about your religion. Isn't it Allah is the one who's in the Bible? I said that Christians use the name. What? I said Christians use the name. I said, why couldn't they use that? That is a like false translation. Allah, that is a false translation. You don't like the name. Then that, use okay. uh, listen, listen. Anything. When you print your Bible, who's forcing you to put Allah? Nobody. Nobody's putting your hands. No, I will tell you. I will tell you who is forcing them. You see, I can tell you who is forcing them. The Muslim, when they want, they say to them, "You can use it." The Muslim, when you say, "You cannot use it," because they are the one in control. And I will show you an example. Let me, you, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. I live where? Do you live in an Islamic state where they force you to do that? No, this is why I say. Okay, no, so you can change your this Bible. Is, this is why. This is why I did. I did. I did. I go to the original. I say Islam. Then Allah is a false god. Well. How many times no. I just said to you, Allah is a false name? Then tell your Christians. Didn't, I, I just told it? them the Christians are listening. I told them this is a false translation. What's wrong with you? Isn't this is the first thing I said to you? But I'm telling you, <laughs> if you don't like the name, my friend, there's a video. Here we go. This is your this is your scholar. I will give you the link. You can watch it and you can laugh at what you said to me that Allah is not a name. This is I your... did not say it's not a name. I said it could be a name. No, it it's a not about could be. It's a name. It's a name. It's a name. It's a possible. But you Muslim do not know what the name means. You do not Hold know on. what the name means. What, what kind of does... what kind Hold of religion? Okay, what let me ask phrase? you. Let me ask you. You are you as a Muslim Shia, right? Okay, I don't follow the scholar. The scholar that you're showing is he's a he's a liar. He's a liar. He's a liar, and he follows Khamenei. I asked specifically from specifically. Uh, okay, I never heard of this Shirazi one. When does Shirazi he die? Sayyid Sar Sayyid Sadiq Shirazi. He's still alive. Okay, I mean, this is why he is not. I never heard of him because he's not a scholar. He's just a sheikh, like everybody. He's not a sheikh. Sadiq Shirazi. <laughs> he is a marja. They don't call him Ayatollah because he's just a random sheikh. 
لكم شيخ شيرازي اوكي ليت اسك يو المرجع اسك يو وات از اوكي يو بيفور الشيرازي الشيرازي ليرن فروم ويتش بوكس فروم ذا شيعة فروم الاحاديث هو از هو از ذس اوكي هو وات از بوك اوف احاديث يو اكسبت Uh, if you can find me a riwaya, a hadith that is sahih and does not contradict the Quran. No, don't tell me a riwaya, a hadith, sahih, here we go, taqiyya of the Shia. Give me the names of the book you approve. What do you mean approve? Yes, I don't you approve a whole book. I'm not, a, I'm not a Sunni. We don't say most authentic book after the Quran. I know that's the Okay, so you are saying guys. that you Muslim Shia, your books are full of corruption too. I believe that there are weak hadith. Yeah, why, why is that Okay, problem? so are you saying to me Allah did not preserve the, the hadith of your prophet and the... And the, the hadith? Did you hear it yourself? The yeah. hadith. Yeah. Did Allah say he's going to preserve the Quran or the hadith? Show me in the Quran where he says he's going to preserve the hadith. Okay, isn't it Allah, he says, obey the prophet and obey Allah? Obey. What does that mean? Does that mean trust every hadith? No. Hmm. How you can obey him if his, his words is corrupt? So if I tell a lie about Jesus and a million other people believe it, that means that I ever believe it. How you yeah? can obey, how you can obey a man, you can you are saying to me that there's many stories say that he said it, it's false. How you can obey him now? Okay. So I'm gonna point this question back to you. And if you can answer this, then I'll be more than happy to answer. It. Go ahead. If you rely on the Bible, which was written by fallible, pay attention, fallible hmm. men. Who were given divine inspiration? How can you trust a book from fallible men, hmm. which were? Is it Muhammad? I mean, no offense, it, but they were so you are not saying to me, smart. are you saying to me the Quran is not written by the hand of fallible men? Did you hear what I just said? I heard you. Are you saying that divinely the Quran? Inspired, are you saying to me? Are you saying to me? Okay. Are you saying to me that the Quran written by the hand of God or the hand of men? Did you, I did not say matter of writing down. I said you. I'm asking you know the matter of writing down. The matter of writing down. The matter of writing down. Okay, are you I saying that you. Muhammad is Muhammad fallible or not? He is masoom. Masoom. Okay, here we go, guys. Did he say masoom? What masoom mean? Explain to us. Infallible, and our concept is that okay. he's free from sin mm. and mistakes. So are you saying he is, guys? He is. He is protected from sin and mistakes, right? And I'm. Can you answer my question before we even? Okay. So how the Quran topic? says in this verse that Allah may Allah forgive you for your sin in the past and the one to come. If Muhammad he have no sin. I don't. I, praying uh, for forgiveness of a sin or Allah saying to forgive you of your sin does not necessitate you had to commit a sin. In my order friend, to it says forgive thee the sin in the past. In the past, if you have no sin, how you will forgive the sin in the past and the one to come in the future? So you're not going to answer my question. Right? I'm answering you. You said to me that the Bible is written by men and Fal they commit uh, no, sin. No, no, no. Let me clarify. Mm. I said you believe that the Bible was written down and the revelation was given to fallible men. How can you trust fallible men with infallible This revelation? is your statement, my friend, not my statement. I'm repeating what you so said. So you believe that the, the men that recorded the Bible are infallible, yeah? You see, we, we believe that the men, they, oh, every man commits sin in the world. But God does so, not. So God, God, men, Jesus said, Jesus, Jesus said, my, Jesus, Jesus said hold on, let me answer you. Jesus said that the heaven and the earth will go and my word will not go. So he is the able only to, to protect the word, not the men. It's not the men who protect the word. It's and not who the men. Revelation? Jesus now, I'm, asking you, I'm asking you, you said that the Quran given by a person who commit not sin. But the Quran saying that Muhammad commits sin in the past and in the future. Why you are lying about your prophet, about your Quran? But you're not going to accept what I just asked you. No, you did not say anything. I, I said, I'm, I'm waiting for the answer. How do you I, believe when Allah he says God, he forgive you? Are trying to, infallible you are revelation trying to change. You have to prove to it that they infallible are. You have man. to prove, my friend. You have to prove that they are bad people. Show me where it says that those say people, that. they are fallible. bad. Fallible. Fallible. What's fallible mean? My, my friend doesn't matter because this is inspiration. That's your God. revelation. What are you talking no, about? No, 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 no. Listen, 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 you see, you see. Revelation is those, fallible men. Listen, listen, listen. So if, if this is the case, then the Quran is the same. You have fallible men. My friend, you, you have a fallible, fallible prophet. You have, you have a prophet who have sex with kids. You have a prophet who kidnap his wife's daughter. My you have, prophet you have a prophet. Kids? So can we, can we compare by can we compare between John and Muhammad? Okay, name for me a bad thing John he did. Now hold on, hold on. You said my prophet had sex with kids. Yeah. <laughs> yes. That, that's what you said. Yes. In I'm going to show you where Moses God commands Moses and the and the children of Israel. Remember, Moses is a prophet. Hmm. A prophet hmm. orders his own 
the orders his own followers to go have sex with kids. You want, to, you want me to show that from, show the, from the Bible? And everybody will love it. You're going to say go, it's not true. Go ahead. You're going to say it's not true, right? No, go ahead. We are waiting for you. All right. In the book of Numbers, chapter 31, hmm. it'd be best in your it'd be in your best interest to bring chapter 31. <clears throat> Read it. Now, of course, unfortunately, Moses was actually told, he, he corrected the children of Israel. The children of Israel only killed the men. But of course, Moses corrected them and said, no, kill even the women. And he says, and Moses said unto them, have you saved all the women alive? Mm. Behold, these that called the children of Israel mm. through the counts of a balance to commit trespass against the Lord mm. in the matter of pure. And there was a plague among the congregation of the Lord. Mm. Now, therefore, kill every male among the little ones and kill every woman that hath no man by lying with him. But all the women children, I didn't use this translation. This translation, which mm. is the King James Version, says women children that have not known a man. So sleep with them that you have not known by lying with them those, which have those sex are, with these women those children. are virgins let me ask you are you um, are, are you a child virgins are, wow. are you are you are a child are yeah. you now you are 20 21 years old are you a child of your mother a child of my mother yes this is not what it says it says women children it's women children the yes the women the they, are, they, they are they are their daughters it's, did you read what I just you see, said? You see, every I don't male... stupid discussion. Hold on. Okay, when you want to prove it to me, every you, male... are, you, are, you are giving interpretation as you wish. Can it's you show me one? Can you show me one first. Jewish? Hold on. You I see, show, I when, when I show when I show to the Muslims their stupidity, I show it to them from their books. Can you show you me our stupidity from our books? Can you show me the interpretation for this verse? One one interpretation. I agree with you. Can you, you show me one interpretation? I'm, I'm not going to repeat myself. You see, you are, you are, you are, you are you a like a kid. Are you, are you willing to show me? Are you show, Are you willing to show me one interpretation? I agree with you. Hold on. Do you want to bring me a scholar that you accept? I'm not. I'm not accepting them. All of 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 them. Nobody says go have sex with the children. You are a liar. Really? Is that why Jews interpreted this? And that's why the this is how the Jews, this is how the Christians, and this is what I'm saying to you. Show me one scholar. He agree with you. Otherwise, you're a liar. Jewish, Jewish scholar. You don't like Jewish scholars, do you? I like Jewish scholar. I said, show me one Jewish scholar. Agree with you. So you know, do you accept the Talmud? <laughs> do you accept that they wrote it in Talmud? My friend, the Talmud is not a holy book. We are talking about the book of Numbers. Why you are why you are mixing scholars, things up? Jewish you see how scholars. you see how you see how, you see how silly you are. You see Bible how silly you are. You see how silly you are. I am a Christian. I am a Christian. I am a Christian. I believe in books, and the Talmud is not a book we believe in. So now I'm asking you. I did not say. Can you, you, have you have show me? You said you want to. Can Jewish you show me? No. Can Jewish you show me? Can you show me? I don't want to repeat myself. I don't want to repeat myself. Can you show me one scholar agree with you? Did you read? Did you hear the verse, by the way? Okay, you see, here we go. So you are, you give up. No, you, you're ignoring, you know what the verse? you're ignoring you know what the verse, the, yeah? you're ignoring the verse that your prophet have say? sex with you kids. Yourself. Okay, hold let me, let me show you. Like hold on, me. hold on, hold on. You did not answer. You, you failed to prove anything in the Bible says that because now, the word of children there, the word of children, the word of children, hold on, the word of children. Where is the little one? Little one. Where is the little one? To marry the little one? It says to marry the little one? It says to marry the little one. It says, now kill every male among the little ones and kill every woman. Look, it's making a distinction between a woman and a little one that have known a man. Do you man know what women mean? All the women children. Do you know what women mean? Not know about a man. Do you know what, do you know what women mean, mean? What women mean? In Arabic, what Imra'a mean? A woman. I'm asking you what the word women mean. Women? Hmm. Even a girl could be called a woman. Yeah, but a girl. A, there we go. You just use the correct word. Woman means so, female. So there is a woman girl. There is a girl, and there is a woman in in, in the language. The word "woman," the word "a woman" is someone she lost her virginity. She is a it woman. Does not say that. It says the woman, right the, 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 one, the female. Man. Now listen, so listen. Okay, let me. Uh, so you fail. You see, this is your interpretation. You can have fun with it. But that interpretation. But, I'm reading word for word. No, 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 no. no. This is your interpretation. You have to show me one read Christian yourself. interpretation. Read says, yourself out loud. Okay, my friend. If I let us make a challenge me and you i show you interpretation of the quran you show me interpretation of the bible and the one who win everybody will laugh what do you think do you believe the bible is literal my friend do you agree to show me one interpretation Agre literal. do you agree do you agree no it's not literal what literal mean what literal mean jesus said the one who drink from my water he will know so does that mean jesus is giving water it's not literal. So, it jesus was making it up yeah he wasn't sharing now listen when jesus he says the one who drink from my water will never go thirsty will never die do he mean really he water serious? Do he really mean water? Do he mean water? 
I'm not sure. I'm asking. What do you mean, not sure? Why? Literal. Somebody told you that Jesus, he have a faucet, he walk around with the water. So listen. I asked you if it's literal. No, you have to prove it. Do you have a proof? Do you, I asked you if it's literal. You said no. That's fine. Okay, so I'm asking you now. I am. But I'm willing to show you from the verse, Quran. I'm willing to show you from the Quran. I'm willing to show you from the Quran that you marry and you divorce kids. Can you show me where in the Bible it says that? You could not. I just showed you. No, the verse doesn't say that. The verse the does Bible, not say that, my friend. Is Everybody is laughing at you. It doesn't say that. So you want you want you want an interpretation of a fallible human being, but you don't want the infallible word of God. Why you see, you because you are giving your own interpretation. You are not giving me. You are giving it. me your I own. I, I'm I'm can saying to again? you, give me interpretation to prove your point. Can I read the part? Can I read the verse? <laughs> and you can. You did already. <laughs> you did I read already. it five times. You did, you did already, you my like friend. My, my friend, you did already, didn't you? Says I kill every male mm. among the little ones. Little ones means kids. Mm. I, I kill every woman. That have known man by lying with him. Notice how it uses the woman, the term woman. Okay, guidance, did you say no? kill every woman who known a man? Verse okay, says, did you did you kill every woman who known a man? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Kill every woman who known a man. Did you say that? And it says, but all the women children. My friend, look, it, this phrase is kill, woman kill children, every. Woman okay, who who they will keep? They will keep the women who don't have a female. So, they, they don't have a man, correct? So kill innocent women, yeah. Well, okay, let me ask you now. Do you want to change topic? We can talk about it. You want to no, talk about no, killing women now? Means, yeah, kill the innocent women, yeah? Well, no, they are not innocent according to this book. Horrid. Did you just hear yourself? You said no. Okay, let me ask you. 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 All of them. Did, did, did the Ali burn people alive? Burning people alive for a specific reason versus killing every okay, single person. Okay, so what is the reason to burn people alive? God commanded. We believe, I know it sounds really difficult to believe that, okay. but we believe God commanded Ali to do that. Okay, if a Muslim but God woman, also if a Muslim woman she leave Islam, if a Muslim woman around. she leave Islam, do you kill her? What's up? If a Muslim woman she leave Islam, do you kill her? Yes, and I can show you a verse in the Bible. But you just said to me, you are saying, but you are saying to me, you see the hypocrisy now. You are saying to me, the verse of the apostle. Okay, let me let me ask you. Let me ask you. When they ask the prophet, when they ask the prophet, we are going now to attack, and we killed children and women from the enemy. Never says that. Never says children. Did he say? Did he say? Never says children. Huh? Never says children. Bring me one where it says kill children. Never says kill children. Okay, here we go. You see, I'm going to show you from the Quran to show everybody from that you. Quran, because I want the word child. A whole day. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. You, you see, because if I show you from the hadith, you will say there's many hadith are corrupt. So let's show you from the Quran. Show me authentic hadith. I said show me authentic. No, no, hadith. no. no, no. I, I will show, show from the hadith. Quran. That's authentic. easy. That's easier. That's easier from the Quran. What do you think about the Quran? Do you accept the Quran or not? The Quran. Do you have the verse that says kill innocent children? Yes. Or kill children, even innocent or not, kill okay. children. Do you have a verse? Please. It says kill many. children. No problem. Do you have it? Here we go. Where does it say? Which ayah? Let us kill see. children. Hold on. Focus. Hold on. Kill children. Do you have the ayah? Read for me. This is chapter 18 about chapter 18. the prophet Al-Khadr. Let me read from here. Now I'm expecting to see the word child. Just no problem. Or children, doesn't matter. It can be plural. Okay. <clears throat> read, read for me. Do you have the what's the verse? Because I don't have the screen in front. Do you have the verse? Chapter 18, verse number 74. 74. Okay. But you notice how you are jumping from place to place or all over the place when we are laughing. I asked you a simple question. I said, what does it mean? When you say, here we go, you, you know. Uh, okay. said, no problem, no problem. People are laughing. Read, okay. This is Quran. This is not Hadith. Because I know you are a Shia. A Shia and they, they love to lie day and night. There's, their bread and breakfast is lying. Taqiyya. Now, read it. This is Quran. Are you going to say this is weak Quran? Did you read the, the context of the story? Don't tell me the context. The you said to me, show me what it says a kid. Okay. <laughs> it's a kid. Okay, yeah, let's see what it says. Let's okay, see what it read says. it. So they set out until they met a boy. Now, of course, it says boy. I mean, I don't know if that means anything to you. Uh -huh. but so now a boy is not, you do not know what boy mean? I said, what does child mean? Because I can call an older person a boy. Really? I call somebody an older person a child. <laughs> okay, okay, why, 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 okay why this boy was killed? Explain to us. 
Allah commanded Al Khidr to, to kill him. Why? Because he was going to cause hardship for his parents. Mm 